Excuse me? Be a beauty pageant, but she just... Welcome back, everybody. <laughs> Dynamite intro, my dear. Japanese game shows. True or false? He's like, what? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Excellent answer. Japanese game shows traditionally are very weird. <laughs> and that's why we're here today to watch some. <laughs> and not understand what's going on, but just to see what people find entertaining in other cultures that might translate to a couple of bums like us. Ooh, this is a good one for Come you. Come on. Honey. Blowing cockroaches. Cockroach blowing game. Now, this could be construed differently in the United States. Wait, so what do you... Blow the cockroach. Oh my god, the versus screen. It's amazing, it looks like Mortal Kombat. No, 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 Oh yeah, blow it in her mouth. No, 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 no. Oh, so it's whoever blows harder gets in Ah, let's I'm go! No, 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 Full speed, just jacking your throat up. They're deep throating a cockroach, all right. You might not have a choice. If you run out of breath, <gasps> okay. Mm. Um, no. Real or candy? This is a game you might like. Real or cockroach? Oh, what? sure, let me just break my teeth to find out. Chocolate. I've seen this, I didn't know this was a game show, but I've Stop. seen this like on TikTok before. <laughs> that is a leaf. <laughs> Uh-uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, real boot. Oh, no, no, that's chocolate, that's a cake. <laughs> so there's a show on Netflix called Is It Cake? And- Same idea, right? Yeah, but they don't bite into it, they cut into it. Right, that, maybe that's what I would remember is the Is It Cake one where- It's cute. These, you know, dessert artists are so good at what they do, you literally can't tell if it's Visually, cake or... but it doesn't involve Biting well, into it. That's the little Japanese spin we put on that. You just got to turn you it up. You don't know whether you're chewing into a shoe or yeah. a piece of chocolate. <laughs> oh, a bow tie. No, just no. It's fun, dog. I mean, once you break it in half, you know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't know how you make a whole ass game show out of that. I know. But, like, well, sure. I guess the contestants have to guess whether they think it's going to be food or not. <laughs> it bobbed up in my feed and it had 37 million views, so I had to watch it. <laughs> it's such a tease because like everyone clicked on that video to see that thing shatter. Is it gonna break rolling down the stairs? Psych, it floats away. Get You're having a little too much fun. I dude, I'm in a good mood right now. So this seems to be a theme in Japan where you just play games and Use re humans. replace the inanimate objects with <laughs> Excuse me? Come on, this was more like a sketch, right? Definitely. This is like, yeah. The version of Saturday Night Live or something. Uh, what? That's awesome. I, yeah, just, I, the, I just have a lot of questions. It's a 30 minute game show of just that. <laughs> it's just, oh man. Tetris, but with humans. This actually looks kind of cool. Here he comes. He's in the play area. Oh my gosh. You gotta squeeze your body into that. Oh, line. weak, oh, come weak. On. Come on, dude. That was sad. I, yeah, I feel like I could have done that. Let's see that. Ain't it is a replay. Like, he wasn't even... Yeah, he tried He tried to finesse it, right? And not do the body shape. Get wrecked. Just get in there. Just get. Yeah, just come on, dude. Rock, paper, scissors? Oh, my God. Jackson would love this one. We played for, like, 20 minutes yesterday. You know what? Oh, I love the dramatic lead-up to... The most intense game of rock, paper, scissors I've ever seen. Do you see the way she looked at her hand? <laughs> what? <laughs> there, this is a legit celebration. She can't believe it. She's not crying over a rock, paper, scissors championship, is she? Look at this production. It's like American Idol. It, like, it's, like a, it's like a beauty pageant, but she just...
So I wonder what the bracket was like. I mean, she must have went through just hundreds of grueling rounds just being a rock purist, crushing her way all the way to the top to throw that final rock to take the crown. Just look at the crowd, the outpouring of support it is just emotional. She can't you know believe what? it. <laughs> I really don't like rock, paper, scissors. How did... I the... know, I just really don't like it. I mean, I don't think it necessitates a stadium full of people crying, but certainly if there's like... I see, I think that enhances the experience. <laughs> <laughs> I prefer it when it's like, well, how do we decide who does what? It's like, all right, best out of three, rock, paper, scissors, boom, boom, boom. All right, you go to the store and get the beers. Sorry. Okay, now Rick we're... Is, now it's getting creepy. Now things just took a turn. things are getting strange. <laughs> yep. yep. What the hell is going on here? <laughs> Excuse you. <laughs> is this the part of I'm getting a little uncomfortable. Is this the part of Japan where uh are we on the wrong website right now? I think we are. <laughs> a different kind of show. You have to wake up cutely. <laughs> With your legs spread. Yeah, just. What the hell is happening? Dude, yeah, th this is what I was thinking about when we were saying like weird Japanese game show. <laughs> Not cute enough. I award you zero points. <laughs> <laughs> Just get her with a pie too, why not? Dude, this is the strangest shit I've ever seen. If anyone has any idea what's going on, please enlighten us. <sighs> Alright, I'm glad we saw that one, because when I think Japanese game show, that's like right up what I like. No, right. you know the only thing I think of when I hear Japanese game show is my favorite. We did oh, a whole video on this before. What is it? X MXC. MXC, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There it is. Oh yeah. I love when this they say the favorite. funniest shit. <laughs> yeah, the, the dubs they do. We did a whole episode on this, what? We like, did, like at year? least one, maybe two. Might have been almost three years ago. <laughs> oh, oh, what? No way. Wow. No way, dude. Okay, uh, I was like, if he made that across, I wouldn't be blown away. We might have done two episodes on this. No, it was so fun. no way. We did it. There was another game show that was I like have a fun Wipeout. memory. Yeah. Uh, Nothing like watching people just wiping out, you know? It is fun. This is the guy's crushing it. Oopsie. Yeah, except he's not. Jinxed it. No way. No way. No way. That's really hard to recover from block. Yeah, bye bye. Oh. Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, bye bye. This says like English announcers? I feel like it's different than the normal MXZ. No. Craig's ridiculous replay. Well, maybe. Yeah, this guy was. I don't know how he managed to do that, but that seemed like a pretty good strategy. I could just picture my wife sitting on the couch relaxing, watching MXZ all afternoon. Yeah, because I sit on my ass and watch TV all afternoon. Well, I wasn't insinuating that. I just meant like I can see it. It's What's the last time you, you saw me relax. sit on the couch in the middle of the day? In the middle of the day, no. There's a very you have a very strict schedule in here too, where post Jackson dinner or post dinner, post Jackson bedtime, boom, PJs on. It's relax Ice time. In hand. Don't talk to me. Don't ask me to do See anything. You later. Yeah. The deadliest this game shows in the world. This Japanese game show gave contestants near-death experiences for fun. It was called okay. Dero, and it challenged people to escape rooms that flooded, walls that slammed, and bottomless pits of death. What? It was almost like a real-life version of the Squid Game, and winners only walked home with ten thousand dollars after risking their lives. Come on! It ran for three years, but was canceled because it was. Because so <laughs> everyone died. How did it last three years? If those were legit near-death experiences, and we weren't just seeing camera tricks there, where they're like the floor comes out and they're on a right. little thing. And for ten grand? Yeah, there had to nah. have been. Maybe it's emulating a near-death experience, but you're not going to fall to your but death. there's a foam pit underneath. But then again, it's a Japanese game show, so who knows? Yeah. Oh, oh, these yeah. Japanese game shows are something else. All right, so this is, this is an actual Japanese game what show. What is happening? Emulating. Yo, did you see that? So they had those little party things in their mouth, right? Yeah. And if they... 
if they accidentally blow them out, they lose or get, yeah, I can see that. But that's the whole thing with the jackets and the numbers. That's all just like an emulation of the show, which I'm sure was tried by a million different production companies. The weirdest Japanese game show. Okay. This show is called the Pantyhose Tug of War. Basically, does everyone that does these things have to talk like that? Yeah. You know, I mean, there's just like, does it, can, I guess you just have to be animated, but after you've been on the internet for a long time and you've seen it a billion times, I just, it's like nails on a chalkboard here. <laughs> Do you want someone to monitor oh. and tell you what's yes. going on in this? Yes! I want everyone video game. to be like Chills. Do you know who Chills is? Obviously not. I don't need to either. No, you have to know who Chills is. Number 15, don't touch. Here's why you should never touch the water in Florida. Shared by Zach Ketchum on both no, YouTube thank you. and Legend. TikTok. I mean, he has made so much cheese, so much chatter. Just doing these types of videos with that uh, incredibly monotone, um, unique voice. Anyways, back to this guy. Let the man speak. It's just two dudes playing tug of war, but they have a pantyhose on their head. And the Come winner on. gets $200,000. But even weirder is this game called Fish the Nose. No, a no, competition no, no, no. where contestants are forced to shove weird objects up their nose. And whoever gets it the farthest no. gets a cash. Right. And this game is called Slippery Stairs. Contestants compete against each other to climb up a set of extremely like, oily stairs. That's like the ice stairs from Home Alone. The craziest Japanese game shows, part seven. One of the crazier game shows is called Marshmallow Rubber Band, also known as Funny Face. Contestants here would wrap a rubber band around their face and then try to eat marshmallows Ow. as fast as possible. What? Why? The trick is, they're not allowed to use their hands, so eating these marshmallows is extremely like difficult, which causes the rubber band to push and make a funny face. Is the rubber band literally just for added effect to make it more entertaining because you look funny. weird? It's amazing some of the things that get funding, huh? This man named Nasabi was selected to participate in a mysterious reality show in Japan. He was given a hard task to stay alone and unclothed in a tiny apartment completely secluded from the outside world. The producers of the show convinced Nasabi that he was participating in a unique experiment. So this I know all about actually because Moist Critical, one of the bigger YouTubers on the planet that does commentary stuff, did a huge deep dive on the show. Huh. And it's actually very dark it was a social experiment of sorts where they basically convinced him that he was on a show or he was going to be winning money but he wasn't and they this dude is just living like this tortured lifestyle for it was a really long time and then they revealed what was happening and ended up getting him to come back and do more to go like I, it was really crazy maybe they'll explain it better than me here but may or may not be aired on television they led him to believe that he was self-recording his day-to-day -day experiences for further review however he didn't know that his most private and personal moments were being broadcast for the world to see and Insane. make fun of wait is that all that's it that's such a short little clip of what the deep dive is pretty wild though it's like the video i watched on it was like 45 minutes he thought he was doing one thing but it really it was like all these hidden cameras just filming his day to day and then once finally they told him what was going on and he realized there was nothing at stake like he wasn't on a game show he wasn't winning money they gave him an opportunity to come back and like do something similar for a real prize this time come on i don't know all i know is i think the dude is just emotionally and mentally damaged damage that's so illegal you can't tell someone they're gonna get money and then not nasabi and the true story come of a through. reality show that destroyed someone's life it's really a crazy story if you ever want to run down that rabbit hole Way to go out on a high note. Well, yeah, yeah, way the to go. most depressing one. Well, yeah, that's how we do it. It's like, yeah, we hit them with the fun pantyhose, rubber band face, marshmallow eaters, Near and death. then you leave them with the Nasubi stories of absolute torment. Like actually life, ruin someone's life. Life ruining social experiments, just how we like it. I tried to parlay into something clever and I came up with nothing. I don't know, but do you want to blow some cockroaches? <laughs> <laughs> After we end this video, I'm just going to sit down and force her to watch that 35 times. Well, I don't really know how to end a video about Japanese game shows, so I guess we'll just see you in the next one. Thanks for joining us. Peace.